Now your storm track weather with meteorologist Gabriela Gomez. Rain is already starting to wrap up this morning for a lot of us. A few spots seeing very light showers. Those should end here shortly. We'll hold on to the clouds through the rest of the day. Breezy conditions as well. Temperatures struggling to warm up later this afternoon. It's a short lived cool down. We'll warm back up heading into Monday and still holding on to that warmth Tuesday. Tuesday afternoon, we'll get our next front to arrive. That will cool us down pretty quickly by the evening hours and also bring in a chance for a few snow showers by Tuesday evening. Here's a look at Manhattan. Still holding on to the clouds, but you can see a few spots starting to break apart. And it's kind of the trend we'll see later on tonight. Maybe a few peaks of sunshine for some. Mostly cloudy in Emporia. Same case for West Topeka. 42 degrees right now. Winds are out of the northwest about 10 miles an hour. Enough to make it feel colder at 36 with that wind chill value. Here's where that rain and cloud cover has really hovered through most of the night. That's why we're seeing some of these warmer temperatures. Further north and west you are, they cleared out pretty quickly and are starting to really get below that freezing mark in spots. We're seeing some of our counties dip down into those 30s as well, just shy of 40 from Manhattan and Junction City. Marysville at 34, also at 39 for Hiawatha this morning. Really don't warm up much through the daytime. We'll be holding on to that cloud cover. May get into the middle to upper 40s. Wind staying pretty consistent out of the northwest, 10 to 15, upwards of 20 miles an hour. They will relax heading into the evening. Overnight changing direction back to the south by early tomorrow morning and we'll get southerly breezes about 10 to 15 miles an hour through Monday afternoon. That'll help boost our temperatures. Still holding on to those winds heading into early Tuesday morning, may even pick up speed close to 20 miles an hour. Then we get that front to slide on through. It'll change the winds back to the northwest heading into Tuesday evening and we'll get some of that cooler air and a chance for a few snow showers late Tuesday. We'll clear out from the clouds tonight. Could drop below freezing in those upper 20s. Shouldn't stop us from warming up through the daytime in those middle 50s with a lot more sunshine heading on into our Monday. Here's a look at that line radar. You can see within the last hour or two really has started to wind down and a few spots seeing light rain showers here and there. Here's a bigger picture of that system drifting off to the east, starting to really fizzle out on the back end of it, and that's where we are. Cloud cover will start will still linger through most of the daytime. We can get a few breaks here and there for some as we go through about mid morning, but still mostly cloudy through the afternoon. Just after sunset, it start to clear out clear skies through the night into the daytime tomorrow, holding on to sunshine late Monday into Tuesday. Those clouds filter right back in most of the daytime dry and a bulk of the heavier snow that we'll see more of an accumulation will stay to our north in Nebraska, but we still could get a few snow showers going through the evening. Doesn't like to amount to much. We'll have been warm through the day, so really don't anticipate a lot of this to stick at all. If not a light coating that moves out pretty quickly. We'll hold on to some of those clouds late Tuesday should clear out maybe on the back end Wednesday. Try to anyway, but we struggle with our temperatures. 50s for the next couple days may even get close to 60 for some Tuesday afternoon before that front arrives and drops our temperatures pretty quickly through the evening. We'll get down into those low 20s by Wednesday morning, struggling out of the 30s for Wednesday afternoon. A short lived cool down yet again should manage to warm things back up some of those low 40s and may even see some low 50s as cloud cover starts to stick around heading on into next weekend.